Here are the nominations. Tamar and Wibyade. American Interior. He was a John Evan man. By this point, he was out of his mind on malaria. He was definitely really depressed by his failure. And he sends a letter saying, Thus, having explored and charted the Missouri for 1,800 miles, I am able to inform you that there is no such people as the Welsh Native Americans. A Welsh man! Kind of like a Tom Jones kind of man. Playing Burton. I find English theatre so boring these days. Broadway is infinitely more exciting. You can open a show at 8 p.m. and by 1 o'clock in the morning you know whether or not to take the next flight out because it's dead, cut, finish. Now at the Royal Shakespeare Company you can play for a whole season with bad notices and people will still come. Why? Because it's the Royal. A circus. Is he bored, Nivy? Connect back home. She no eat sugar. She bad. Had a mint, Africa. Please had a mint. Had a heart Please had a heart early. What up already? And the winner is. Are you missing you? Playing Burton. Well, this is a surprise. Gosh, um, an extraordinary journey with this uh, film. Um, a wonderful stage play written by Mark Jenkins with an, an incredible track record. Uh, and if you have wonderful writing, you can always, uh, I think, produce a decent film at least. Um, but I have to say a huge thank you to everybody that was involved. Um, from David Hughes, who put up the money for us to make it, to Sky Arts, who bought it off us, to Gaynor Messer Price, who was the producer, obviously to Mark Jenkins, who was over there, for his ins incredible script, and, um, and for a wonderful and absolutely amazing performance by Josh Richards. So, thank you very much. So can you tell us a little bit about the, the original sort of concept and development and how, how it all came about? Well, it was a stage play and it's been performed all over the, all over the world. And um, it was a one-man show. And I don't think any broadcaster would have touched it, frankly. But we just had this belief that we could open it out, um, set it in various locations and almost treat it like a, a multi-actor um, drama production. And it seemed to work. I mean, uh, um, but Josh Richards was absolutely extraordinary in the role. And, um, and you know, I mean, it was it was pick of the week in the Sunday Times and the, the Daily Mail and the Express and God knows what. And we were very, very shocked with that. And this is the culmination, I think. And what were the main sort of challenges from your side adapting the story uh, to the screen? Um, what sort of um, obstacles did you have to overcome? Well, principally, uh, you know, when you adapt anything from the stage to the screen, they always, you know, it, 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 there's always a risk because you have a very contained um, kind of setting, uh, which could be quite monotonic. Um, but I, I just think Josh was so sublime in the role that we just had to do, we committed to it. So the big challenge really is, I mean, one actor on the screen for 92 minutes and not boring the audience. So we tried to keep the camera moving, set in lots of different locations, and so it was, there was a lot of visual variety. So, um, yeah, I mean, it was wonderful. And Josh's performance, as you say, is incredible. How, how did he sort of get into character and, and what, was, what kind of research did he do? Um, well, we know the Burton family. Um, we shot some of the film actually in uh, Sean Owen's house, which is the Burton home in Pontry de Ven. Um, and uh, I think they've known the Burton family, certainly Mark Jenkins has for 35 years, you know. Um, so that was one way of doing it. But uh, I think that the, 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 the main thing really was 
making it as filmic as we possibly could. I mean, Talking Heads, uh, the Alan Bennett series, with half-hour pieces where there's only two or three camera angles, but you can't sustain that for 90, 92 minutes. So the, the, the real challenge was making sure that we, you know, kept people interested, as it were. And without a, f a fabulous central performance, I think people would have been bored. So, I mean, I'm, here I am with this, really, it's for them.